हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू टोमर ट्यूटोरियल आई एम अभिषेक तोमर हेर आई टीच यू पायथन पायथन इज ए प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज एज यू नो दैट एज वी नो दैट बिफोर गोइंग टू डिस्कस पायथन वी हैव डिस्कस व्हाट इज द प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज एंड व्हाट हाउ मेनी टाइप्स ऑफ प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज आर एग्जिस्टेड ओके दीज आर सम प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज लिस्टेड हेयर सम ऑफ in which some of uh, we know like java c c++ and one of them is python today we are discuss about py python okay what is the programming language a programming language is a set of commands comma instruction and other syntax used to create a software program means a software is a, set, a software is a set of program and a program is a set of instruction okay you can also say a software is a set of programs programs is a set set of instructions so that's why a programming language is a set of commands instruction and other syntax used to create a software program how why we need programming language suppose two person are talking to each other so they have to required a medium or a language to talk to each other okay so that's why here we are talking to computer so we required the programming languages computer didn't computer is not able to understand our our mother tongue okay our native tongue or as like hindi english so they have required the programming language so so these type so these type of languages are called the programming language which or which are understand by the computer <coughs> sorry okay so so this is the reason we have required a programming language to command to execute our commands to run our software to make our software we require the programming language overall overall we have to say that to communicate with the computer we have to require the programming languages okay so how, there are two types of programming languages low level language and high level language <coughs> low level language uh, such assembly and machine if you have not heard about this then you have then you have not worry about this okay there is no need to discuss these or these all things we will discuss on only about the python and the python is high level language such like such like that c c++ java okay these are the types of programming language so now comes to the introduction of the python okay here is the overview of the python what is python python is a high level language high level level language as i told you okay python is also a scripting language a scripting language is written in the last point okay what is the scripting language as we know uh, if you are familiar something if you are familiar little bit about the linux and unix then you know what is the script and what is the scripting language okay if you are, if you have not familiar about the linux then you then you then it is not to worry about that i will tell you a scripting language is a computer language with a series of commands within a file that is capable of being executed without compiled <coughs> means you don't have a need to compile that script means set of commands script is a set of commands in a file okay series of commands or set of commands in a file which is ready to executed not to compile okay this is all about a scripting language python is interpreted language okay there is no need to compile the program as i told you in the scripting language there is no need to compile okay we have directly run the script or execute the script easy to learn and use we have seen uh, in in more lecture that how can we learn this and how it is easy to learn other compared to other programming languages object oriented language if you are familiar with java and c++ then you know what is the object oriented means class inheritance polymorphism abstraction these type of concepts are also exist in the python so that's why it is called the object oriented programming language 
interactive powerful and portable these are all the <coughs> all the properties of the python programming language okay this is all about python programming language and how python is interpreted language and what is the interpreter and how is different from the compiler it is discussed in the next slide compiler and interpreter there are two types of these are two different things compiler and interpreter compiler takes the whole program as the input means if when you written whole program and then you have then you compile the program it will take whole program as the input but the interpreter takes this line by line means instruction by instruction as the input compiler required high memory and interpreter requires low memory because of the intermediate code or the object code compiler required the high memory and the interpreter requires a low memory intermediate code is generated this that's why this is the point intermediate code is generated that's why the compiler required the high memory and here is no intermediate code so here is very low amount of memory required errors are shown after whole program is compiled as we have discussed that compiler takes the whole program as the input so the error will come after the whole program of the execution okay and here the interpreter errors will display after every instruction okay because it takes the every single instruction as the input c compiler java compiler and many more c++ compiler we have seen and here is the basic perl python there are more pro more programming language which are scripting language so here is also interpreted language basic python and perl okay this is all about what is the programming language and how many types of programming language and what is the python and what is the compiler and the interpreter okay hope you guys learned something thank you for watching for more update and videos in the python programming tutorial please like the video and subscribe the channel thank you